At Dairy Queen, maintaining the proper temperature of our products is key to food safety. Cold foods such as DQ soft serve and milk can be potentially hazardous when stored at incorrect temperatures. Improper cold holding temperatures are critical food safety violations. Let's take a look at the steps you need to have in place to ensure that you are maintaining proper temperatures for DQ soft serve and milk. The ideal holding temperature is 33 to 38 degrees Fahrenheit. This temperature range ensures that the holding temperature of product always stays below the maximum holding temperature of 40 degrees Fahrenheit. In order for your cold foods to maintain proper temperature, you need to make sure that your equipment is working properly. If it is not working correctly, take action to fix or replace the equipment as soon as possible. Maintaining the temperature of milk is very easy. Milk should be stored in its original container and under refrigeration at all times. Make sure your crew members are not leaving it out on the counter. Maintaining the temperature of DQ soft serve is critical for maintaining quality and overall flavor. Here are some best practices for maintaining soft serve temperatures. When soft serve is delivered, check the temperature of several cases and record on the receiving log. Check the temperature by holding the bag around the thermometer. Reject any mix with a temperature above 40 degrees Fahrenheit. Monitor your soft serve temperature. There should be a thermometer in our cab freezer. Temperature should be recorded a minimum of two times a day. Minimize opening the soft serve cabinet by changing mixed bags as quickly as possible. At the end of the day, remove mix from the cab unit and place in the walk-in cooler until the next day. Keeping food safety a priority in your location ensures happy, healthy fans and crew members. Remember, the ideal holding temperature is 33 to 38 degrees Fahrenheit. Check temperatures of delivered mixed bags and reject any with a temperature above 40 degrees Fahrenheit. Minimize opening the soft serve cabinet by changing mix bags as quickly as possible and place mix back in the walk-in cooler until the next day.